Good morning, Sacred Heart. I'm Jordan Burns, and today is Monday, April 12th, 2021. Listen up for your morning announcements. Congratulations to our basketball team on winning the state for the first time since 2004. We are so proud of you. Josie Gilvin was named the state MVP, and Alex Wolf and Trinity Ralston were named the All-State Tournament Team. Coach Moyer also achieved her 701st win with the state championship win. Congratulations again, girls. We are so proud of you. Now on to student life. Are you interested in a leadership position at Shaw? Do you want to help plan Shaw events like Frosh Blast, the Turkey Bowl, Catholic Schools Week, the Talent Show, and more? Student Council team representative elections are coming up. Join us for an informational meeting either April 21st at 10 a.m. or April 22nd after school at 2.50. Both meetings will be digital and a link will be sent out. Attendance at one of these meetings is required to run. See you there. The Go Green Club is hosting a Brightside Neighborhood Cleanup event on Monday, April 19th after school at 3.15 p.m. We will be picking up trash in St. Matthews over on Stilts Avenue. This will count as one hour of service and a reminder that hours are due soon. Space is limited. Students who are interested need to sign up on the Sign Up Genius link that is posted on shawterracycle.weebly.com or email mcupper at shslou.org and request a copy of the link or to find out more information. Now let's check out this video from Shaw's TerraCycle. Detective Terra, Detective Cycle, we have a new case for you involving the Green Five. We've been hearing reports throughout Sacred Heart School of a mysterious stranger going on a spree of five various good environmental deeds. We need you to find this do-gooder and reward them with a fresh, shiny dress-down pass and a Green Five pin. Well, let's get to it. I found a fingerprint. Look at this environmental poster for Earth Day that includes a call to action such as turning off the water when you brush your teeth. This must be the do-gooder. They strike again. What a good deed. Look over here. I found matching fingerprints on the new items in the TerraCycle bin. They donated Burt's Bees packaging. Oh my goodness. I found a third fingerprint and it matches. It's on this trash bag that was used at our neighborhood cleanup. I wonder how many service hours they got for that. Wow, we! I found yet another matching fingerprint on this petition against the harmful fishing industry. Oh, and look, their name is on the confirmation sheet. Jane Valkyrie. Wait a minute. I follow her on Instagram. And look, she just shared our post about the new Green 5 program for Earth Week. She completed one, two, three, four, five whole tasks on our list which means she gets a dress down pass for either May 3rd or May 6th and a green five pin. Don't forget, she must visit either Senora Cooper or Senora Griffin's room with pictures or evidence of her deeds before she can be rewarded by either April 27th or 29th. So true. And here's the form she has to fill out. But look, there are two more options that she could have completed in order to reach the goal of five deeds. You can find more information about the Green 5 Challenge and each of the environmental actions on either shawterracycle.weebly.com or on the Shaw Go Green Club Instagram page. Remember, you only have to complete five of the challenges in order to receive your dress down pass and pin. Remember, TerraCycling can be dropped off in front of the cafeteria before school and the collection for TerraCycling ends on April 22nd. It's a good thing Jane Valkyrie completed her five. We better get this information to Senora Cooper or Senora Griffin so one of them can confirm it. Hello? Okay, thank you very much. Wow, we! She already confirmed. Let's make sure that Jay knows to go to room 303 or 305 by April 27th or 29th to get her dress down pass and green 5 pin. Invite your family and friends to Salsaritas on Tuesday, April 20th to support the Kentucky Health Club. A portion of the proceeds will be donated to Hope Scarves with code QUESO at checkout. Hope Scarves donates scarves and shares stories with women in breast cancer treatment. Email Sally Harrison or Caroline Elliott with questions. The 100 Club will have a meeting on Tuesday after school. It is in the gym and will start at 245. Anyone is welcome, and if you want to join virtually, please email Anna Mormon for the link. We will be planning Cure Week, which is a week away, so come up with lots of ideas. 
The countdown is on 22 days until all Valkyrie service hours are due. Freshmen and sophomores, you are working towards 20 hours. Juniors and seniors, keep moving towards 25 hours. Remember, service this year is to family, neighborhood, and community. Check out the service at a glance flyer in your Schoology service course and in your theology classroom for details. The service bulletin board is loaded with opportunities and ideas. Don't forget, Valkyrie serve. Now on to sports. The lacrosse team plays in the Braveheart tournament this week. Get out and support your Valkyrie lacrosse team. Come out and support your tennis seniors this Thursday, April 15th for Tennis Senior Night. The swim team will compete in regionals this Friday at Blairwood at 5 o'clock, so be sure to cheer them on. Now to Zuri for lunch and weather. Hey Valkyries, the weather for today is a high of 72 and a low of 46. Hey Valkyries. Thanks Zuri. That's all we have for today, Sacred Heart. Have a great day.